okay, what, before we leave breakfast, everybody has to make sure they're fully watered up. If you got a backpack space or whatever, take an extra water at least. Make sure you got at least a couple snacks in your bag. Basically, be ready to spend the night out after we leave the truck, just in case. Because it never, can't be too ready for that. Yeah. You got room? Feel free to bring something extra. Might not be for you, but it might be for somebody else. <coughs> you guys sound pretty, pretty enthused about that. <laughs> <laughs> trying to pull his bike backwards up the hill to get to the other trail and he, he can't, right as he almost got it the bike straightened back out the wrong way fill up with water everyone's got to get lots of water a couple snacks etc etc you could have been you could have been watching the, the show the game no it probably was was it on the news or something or there's a there's a million channels up in the freaking on the TV. To come and call me. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh my god. <laughs> this is nothing. You can't even say any compare it all, anything about it. I'll bet the first day and a half it was way tougher and better than your first three day trip with those other guys. Absolutely. Absolutely. Not to mention, I mean, isn't it a prerequisite on the other guy's trip that you actually have to bend down, kneel down and pan? Oh, I didn't have to do that part. Don't lie. Was the guy whose name is on the trip actually on the trip? No. Yeah, that usually doesn't happen to He visited us at the restaurant, though. He met you guys once? Yeah. <laughs> That's mighty big of them. They wanted to... My car. Pin the topping. Can you ride it out of there or do we gotta lift it? Yeah, ride it up and then back up on the road. I said we got a bike in a ditch, but everything's fine. We'll be on the way in five minutes. If you dump it in, you I'm being fucking lazy. Do you just slide off? I didn't slide off, I fucking broke.